After calculating energy, the next logical step is to calculate economics. Up until now, it has been possible to enter data into Trace without any sort of customization. The existing library members have been moderately sufficient. However, calculating economics accurately is impossible without creating a custom rate structure. Please take a look at the standard economic rate structures available in Trace. These are examples, and the prices are very outdated. Chances are, if you use these rates for anything other than preliminary runs or for testing, you are going to get slapped. Therefore, now is a good time to introduce the use of libraries. Nearly all components in Trace are kept in a library database. Interestingly, the library database is separate from a Trace file. It is important to understand the library database is unique to your computer, unless, of course, you have a network license, in which case your library database is unique to your network. In any case, it is necessary to understand that library items are not located within a .prc file. Instead, they are located within a file called lib7.db. Before we get into editing libraries, Let's just...